What is up, guys? Welcome back to another abandoned high school adventure. Today, guys, I'm here with my friend Motley Kiwi from Static Spaces, and we are checking out this old, very old, abandoned high school. Currently, I'm in the gymnasium. It's very yellow in here. It's old, <clears throat> old brick walls. Guys, this place is huge. There's two gyms. There's a massive auditorium. So many classrooms, hallways, lockers. Very old, very old high school in Ontario, Canada that are going to be demolished. More information on that to come throughout the video, but let's get right to it, guys. Cue the music, cue the intro. See you guys on the other side. All right, guys, here we go. We're starting in the gymnasium. where I started my intro, and we are in bear country, guys. Check it out, bear country. Got some seats here, we've got the gymnasium. I believe there are two of these. All right, so let's, uh, let's move on. Pretty much exactly the same as the other one, guys. We got a ball here. That's a dodgeball. Got a dressing room over here. It's very yellow in here. The lights make it very yellow. See what else we got here. Oh, this just goes behind the gym. Okay, I see. Oh, well, that was no fun. And this just goes back in to where we just were. Outside, guys. We don't want to go outside. All right. So we got these classic old brick walls painted. Looks like the music room. It's cold in here. There's water all over the floor. <sighs> Lots of water in here, guys. Am I 
school never had paint all over the lockers when I was in the school. It's in here. Oh, check out the science lab. I got a record player in here. Wow. Science labs are always cool. guys here's our periodic table of elements here all right take some notes there'll be a quiz at the end of the video all right there it is uh, now on April 1st after we come back from the break uh, we'll be doing a complete dissection of the brain which will include a lab handout uh, you'll be expected to read the next lab which is banana DNA extraction very important complete the online DNA questions for next in-person class, which will be on April 9th. Lastly, number three, you are fully re uh, expected to do DNA replication and discovery reading uh, of the Ch and Pugs uh, are referenced to, uh, to Campbell. And in the Nelson text in your desk, the pages are 205 and 202. 205 and 222. Thank you. In case you didn't get that, it is 205 and 222. Uh, what is up, guys? Welcome to science class. I am your teacher today, and my name is Mr. Freak Photography. My name is Mr. Freak Photography. I'll be your teacher for today. Please take notes. Please put your phones down, and please pick up your textbook to uh, page 69. Oh, guys, look at this room. Holy cow, it's so colorful. Huh. This must be the art room, guys. Who do we got here? I'm going to guess we have Jim Morrison on the left, Janis Joplin, Jimi Hendrix, and I can't make out who the person is on the right. Looks a little bit like Hulk Hogan, but I know it's not Hulk Hogan, but I can't make out who it is. This is quite the interesting room. All the art's been left behind for us to look at. Wow. All right. Found the auditorium. Holy cow. Holy cow, guys. This is awesome. Crazy. Holy boy. Okay, guys, so I found a uh, graduation gown and another cap, so I'm going to wear this uh, pretty much for the duration of this video because uh, I'm a jackass like that. So we're going to take a tour of this auditorium here before I take some photos. So let's turn the camera around here. And we'll just check out this whole auditorium from this part right here before we head upstairs. I'll show you from upstairs. Beautiful windows over there. There's some stained glass windows on both sides. They have curtains and they have lights. I bet you I could make the lights work. I could probably make the curtains open and close. Beautiful auditorium. And this is going to be demolished, guys. They're going to tear it down.
So we're going into stage left here, guys. Okay, stage left, as you can see right here. Head up here into the stage area. What do we have here? Nothing. Okay. And what have we back here? Nothing. I'm looking for some controls, guys, so that we can push some buttons and things. Let's see here. Maybe if I go over here. Screen up, screen down. Oh, here we go. Yeah, the screen's coming down. See? All right, so we found that button. And we got here it's all kinds of controls up there hmm what's in here nothing that's that light right there so this light controls up there we're gonna have to go up there and mess around guys we're gonna have to climb up here in our gown right so I just realized that if I go up there to push the buttons and play with all the lights and the buttons, well, I won't be able to see what I'm doing because I can't see the, uh, the auditorium. So there's a suitcase over here. What's in here? Well, it's an empty suitcase, but I also found a trap door. Here, let's see here. Whoa, look at that. It goes right down there. What was down there? It's a heavy door, guys. Whew. I don't know what that is. Anyways, enough goofing around. I'll take some pictures and then we're going to head up there. So I'll see you guys in a bit. What's up, guys? Still here. Still wearing my graduation suit and my, and my cap. I found the uh, I found the principal's office, guys, right, right here. We've got a big problem here, guys. We're going to get sent to the principal's office. All right, we're not going to go in there right now, though. We're going to continue our tour here. Here we have a gender-neutral washroom. Hmm. Gender-neutral washroom. Interesting. And then here's your auditorium where we just were. Now, I do got to go try and find the pool. Uh, Kiwi and, uh, and Static Spaces did say that there's a swimming pool in here. So we got to try and find it. But I do also want to go check out the top of the auditorium while we're here. So let's go see the top of the auditorium. And then we're going to go try and find the pool, all right? Grab my camera here. And we head on up these stairs. Very nice. What's up here? It's like a secret room. Oh, that's the uh, projection room. Okay, we'll do that in a minute. All right, there you go. Nice view from the top. Okay, guys, we're going to go down to the, uh, the 
bottom of the mezzanine here so we can see the uh, auditorium. So I'll just turn my camera around. You guys can have a look here from the top. Here you go. Pretty nice, eh? It's good that the lights are on still. You don't have to worry about lighting up the whole room. Makes me happy. Okay, I'm gonna take some more pics and then we're gonna go up to the uh, projection room. So I'll be right back. Okay, one more look. One more look around here, guys. Head on up here now. See what's going on up here, guys. Nothing. Guys, there's nothing going on in the projection room. That's it. Yeah, that's it. Okay. Nothing to see here. Okay, I'm gonna go and find something cool. I'll be right back. Okay. Let's go. Office is in here. We're on the mission to find the pool. Oh, that's not very responsible, guys. Whoever did that, it's not very responsible. I think that was supposed to say something else. Swimming pool, found it. All right. It's always fun to find a pool, guys. Hey? Eh? diving board. It's no fun. All right, this looks like we're in the uh, cafeteria kitchen area. Yeah, definitely cafeteria here. It is big old cafeteria.
This school, I don't even know where I am, guys. This school's so huge. I don't even know where I am. Might as well sign my name on the board, guys. I already signed it once, but we'll do it again. Actually, I've done it twice because I did a science lab, too. All right, here we go. We'll do it right here. Oh, that's such a long name. There. Okay. Before we head down this hallway, I'm going to uh, take some pictures, so be right back. Okay, guys, here we go. We're leaving the cafeteria, and we're making our way down to the hallways here. Check out some classrooms, and we'll see if there's anything interesting. Looks like we might have some asbestos tiling here on the floor. I'm not too sure. Every time I'm in a room like this, people say, Oh, my God, that's asbestos tiling. Be careful. Check this out. Open it right up there. There you go. That's pretty neat. Well, this was the weight room. This was the gym, guys. All right. The weight room. in here something with lights on the ceiling hmm That was the principal's office. So we came from down there. This is where we saw that word, sperm. I don't know, maybe that's what it's supposed to say. It just feels weird to me. But maybe it's an acronym for something. This is a pretty cool hallway here. Really old, small lockers. They haven't been used in a long time. As you can see, the lockers are, uh, are zip-tied shut. So this is a really old hallway with small, small lockers. Pretty cool. All right. We've already been here because that's the gymnasium. I mean, the auditorium. And let's see here. It's very dark in this hallway. So I'm going to turn the lights off and we'll start filming again when we get somewhere brighter. Okay guys, so I'm gonna to go to the very top floor and then I'm gonna work my way down from there. It's what I should have done in the first place, but uh, that's what I'm doing now, okay? All right. We just got one more floor to go from here. Now I thought it would be warm in here, but it's not, it's really cold. 
Oh, I don't know if I can go up here. Ooh. Okay, so they're doing abatement on the top floor. So, I can't go there. You can see the uh, orange tarp. So we'll go to the second top floor, right here. Dark, guys. It's dark up here. You guys, found the library. There's probably no books. But let's go in the library. Empty, guys. And dark. Empty and dark. Hmm. All right, let's move on. Someplace different. All right, we got lights on over here so we can see. All right, what's in this classroom here? No clue. It is a lab. Very small one, though. Here's a larger one right here. Cold in here, guys. Whew. Oh, it's because there's a window open. That's why. Whew. All right, we've got another classroom here. Big smiley face on the wall. Hmm. I'm guessing this was a computer lab, maybe. Le yeah, learn HTML, introduction to HTML, HTML document standards. All right, yeah, so this is like a, uh, I mean, when I was in school, this would be called the computer lab. <laughs> I don't know what they call it nowadays. Okay, okay. Oh, it's so cold in here, guys. In here. Okay, let's see what's in this room here, guys. Oh, nothing. Whole bunch of nothing, guys. Let's carry on, see if we find anything of interest. Another lab. All right, I'm a little underwhelmed here. So uh, I'm not going to just keep filming as I walk. If I see something neat, I'll bring you guys in. All right, back into the dark areas here. Just showing you guys around a little bit, all right? Oh, 
Okay guys, time to wrap this video up. I gotta go wrap it up, tie it up in a nice little bow. Hope you guys have liked this one. Big, huge, abandoned school. Not really abandoned, but it's closed down. They're tearing it down. It's gonna be demolished. This whole building is gonna be gone within a matter of months, unfortunately. It's a beautiful school, beautiful auditorium. Thanks to my good friends Motley Kiwi and Static Spaces. I can hear Static Spaces behind me running around. I don't know where Motley Kiwi is, but they're here somewhere. Let's see if you guys can find me. Can you see me somewhere? Can you guys find me? Do you know where I am? Am I over here? Nope. Am I over here? Nope. Do you see me yet? I think you might see me now. <laughs> here I am, guys. Okay, so here I am again. I'm upstairs now. So anyways, that wraps up this video. Hope you guys have liked it. Thanks for watching. You guys know what to do. Hit the like button. Drop me a comment. Share the video if you can. And if you're not subscribed, hit that subscribe button. Go back and uh, check out my old stuff. It's not very good, but my newer stuff is getting better. Lots more interesting stuff to come. So thanks a lot, guys, for being here. Thanks to Static Spaces, Motley Kiwi, for joining me here. Oh, and one last thing before we go, guys. If you want to wear this photography hoodie that I'm wearing, it says Freetography in the front. What is up, guys, in the back? I got Freetography hoodies and t-shirts in my merch store. Hit the link in the video description. Check it out. Pick up some Freetography merch. That's it, guys. I got to go. See you next time. Peace.